This is an aluminum head or jug. With the vibration I'm having on the chainsaw mill, it's just it's chewing these threads up. It's to the point where I can take a boot a bolt and push it into the hole and pull it back out. No turning required. Threads are shot. Um, the next move I am going to make is helicoils. If you're not familiar with helicoils, I think some people refer to them as king certs. They are uh, a replacement thread. You buy them in a kit. Comes like this here. Comes with this tool. And it came with the tap and the Gila coils. And the Gila coils look like this. They're basically steel threads. And what you're going to do is you're going to have to, according to the size of Gila coil you're using, it tells you in your instructions what drill bit you need. You need to make the hole a little bit bigger so you can screw in the Gila coil with your tool. Now if you notice on this hole, you can see I've inserted it already in there. The other side I have saved to show you how it's done. Let's uh, throw in a Gila coil. Okay, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run this tap into that hole which I have already drilled with the required bit. Okay, now since in my situation the hole's back in there and this is the tool you're gonna use for the tap. It's got a hole in it. You insert the tap into the hole giving you a tapping tool. Well my problem is my hole set back in. I'm not going to be able to turn this. So I am using a quarter inch extension for my socket set, which still fits the hole in the, in the tool. And I'm going to slowly, nice and straight, go a turn, back it out, clean the threads. Go a couple turns, back it out and use the and clean the threads and you're going to do this until you're all the way in now I did put a little bit of oil on the tap clean the threads Okay, I've got it all the way in. Now I'm going to back it out, clean all the shavings out of the hole, and we're going to insert the healer coil. Okay, now the healer coil. Open the package. Which this package came with three Gila coils. I seen when I was at the store that you can buy the Gila coils individually. Well, not individually, but in assorted packs. After you have the tool, but you're going to need the tool for each size, so I don't know that that's a big advantage. Okay, Gila coil has a little tang on the end, which goes across the center. That little tang goes on the bottom, and there's a slot on the bottom of the tool. We're going to drop that tang right into that slot, and that's going to enable us to turn it. Ooh, almost forgot. The problems I've been having, I'm going to put some Loctite on it. I'm going to use the red, it's supposed to be the best. Okay, so now I've got my Loctite on my Gila coil. Now we're gonna start inserting it. You wanna take nice, 
you know you don't want to go at this too fast you don't want to screw up what you've got so just take your time and this is not like the tap you don't have to back it out clean the threads you just turn it in now what you're going to want to do though is you're going to want to make sure that the helicoil is a good quarter quarter to three quarters of a turn below the surface in other words you don't want the helicoil sticking out farther than this than your edge okay now if you look back in there so i'm hoping the camera is picking this up you got nice new threads now in both holes after you get your helicoil inserted and you take that little groove there on the end you're going to want to break that tang off that goes across the center of it so what we're going to do is we're going to line the tang up with our tool and then we're going to pull our, our tool out and turn it to where they're not lining up okay now i'm going to have to uh set the camera down and you can see i'm holding the tool in there now what i'm going to do is just take my hand there, I broke off the tang in the back. That's how you insert a helicoil. Uh, I've used them several times before. I've never had to go back and screw with whatever I've replaced it with before. I'm hoping it's the same on the chainsaw. If you like what you see here, leave me a comment, like it. Check out my channel. All kinds of videos on there. Thanks for watching.